You said that you feel lonely, makes you cold as ice. Harder get to know me, but better than the lies. No way I'd let you slip by. No way I'd let you say bye. You said that. Hey guys back with another video for my addictive blogging channel so i have the nothing phone one and in this video i will be discussing how you can turn the nothing phone one into a pedometer or fitness tracker not only that we will also see some of the really really nothing phone one secrets with which you can change the way you use this phone and also improve the overall experience of nothing OS which comes with this phone so as always this will be a sick video guys and if you are attending sales don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because i will be making more videos like this first of all the nothing phone one comes with a lot of features and nothing phone one also has some secret features which can change the way you use your phone so the version i am running is android version 13 and i have got the last update for first november 2023 and also i am running the nothing os 2.0.5 which comes with the latest version of android and i have not installed the beta version because most of the features are there in the version nothing was 2.0.5 and also the build is stable that means you will get the smooth nothing OS which comes with the phone and there are less hiccups or delays in the overall experience so let's see how we can change this phone into a fitness tracker so to change the phone to a fitness tracker i don't need to install any of the apps because this feature comes by default in the nothing phone one you just need to find it and make the proper use of the features that are in the nothing thing was 2.5 after that what you want to do is come to the default home screen and here you need to press and hold in the empty space you will get the option widgets and in the widgets you will get a lot of new widgets from nothing and here you will get the pedometer widget so you just need to click and hold and drag it first of all after you drag it you need to make sure you do some of the settings in here so you need to click and hold there will be an edit icon and here you need to specify the number of steps you want to complete each and every day so you need to decrease it or increase it according to your choice and i will recommend you to complete 6000 steps in a day because that is the standard amount of steps which needs to be completed to stay fit or stay healthy so I will keep it as 6000 and whenever I will be working the phone will automatically detect my movement and here it will show the total number of steps today and the 7 day average. So here you can see today there is a 16% completion of the steps and also the average is 14% that means it is giving me a really good stats that means it also shows me how many steps i need to complete in order to reach my goal and after that you also will see if i scroll down the red dots that means the red dots are the days where i have walked or i have done some of the activity so if i have not done any activity it will be grayed out make sure you are using this widget to keep track of daily step count and also there is a nice animation which will go on when you will be working and nothing has given a lot of details to this widget because this person which is in the widget is also denoting how much percentage of step count i have completed so 16 percent is completed that means it is not very far away from the starting point and once the goal is completed the person will move to this position so i have completed my daily goal of step count and there is a nice animation when you will be doing some activity Activity, which is really, really great so this is how you can turn your nothing phone one into a pedometer or fitness tracker and definitely it will help you to complete your daily goals not only that if you are going somewhere and you lost the way there is another widget that can really change the way you use your phone and that is the newly added compass widget suppose you have gone somewhere and lost your way 
and you need a compass then the compass widget can be really really handy of course we have the google maps but in case you want something in your home screen that will guide you to a destination the compass widget is newly added and it works like a charm so there are some of the editing options it is not a compass it is also a altimeter and in the altimeter you can denote what will be the unique for measuring the altimeter so you can enable the haptic feedback for that and how to see the compass and altimeter you just need to scroll down and it can take some time to get activated and definitely answer click you will see the compass is there and the details are so good that once it hits the north position you can see it will turn to red which is a really really good thing to have in this phone and also you will be seeing that i am getting the live altitude points and latitude points so here the altitude it is showing as 2691.6 feet and these are the latitude and longitudes which are really, really great to have on the widget directly and this widget will not work all the time but definitely it will work when you will be clicking on it so once you are done with the compass you can click and disable the widget so that it conserves the battery and on top of that there are some other functions so this is a widget which shows the screen on time and this screen on time will be helpful to know whether you are using your phone correctly or not so you can also denote a limit of screen on time which is 6 hours 30 minutes I have kept but it is too much for a normal person the screen on time should be around 2 hours maximum so you can keep it as 2 hours as the daily limit and here you can see just showing me how much screen on time I have up today because it is at the end of the limit of screen on time it is showing it in red at the end so definitely a really useful feature and it doesn't show it directly you need to just scroll up to get the screen on time here and you can scroll down to hide it and on top of that there are other features like the weather widget this is the music widget so whenever you will be playing any of the music in spotify or anywhere the music widget will be coming into play so the music widget not only shows you the music that is playing but also the music where it is playing like i'm playing it on spotify and also there is a bar which denotes how much music is left so really really nice widget to have to get the song detail this will show you the music that is playing and it will also change so as soon as i change the music you can see the music widget got changed with this really really good visualizer which looks really good and you can also pause the music from here which is really really great so there are other features also not only you can pause the music by tapping on it also you can go to the next track by just sliding right or left so here you can see the track is changing which is really great because the widget is so well designed and it looks so good on the phone that i am really really happy to see this on the nothing phone one and how they have implemented this one so to pause it you just need to tap it once and it will be paused and another thing is you can configure folders which looks really good so this is a folder widget and you can see i have kept the secret apps in this folder widget you can change the way it looks by holding on it and going to customize and here you will see all the types of things you can do with this folder widget so folder style you can change so there are a few of the folder style and this is the best part because with this you can change the cover and there are so many cover in the dot matrix style like there is a game there is this one there is cherry there is suitcase there are so many cover which you can add and once you are done you just need to click back and all the things will be organized in here you can even change the name of the folder and definitely everything you can organize in the home screen by sweet little cover which are there it looks really beautiful on the nothing phone one so these are the things you can do with the nothing phone one and definitely you can see how i have turned my nothing phone one into a fitness tracker or pedometer it looks really, really good on the phone so guys, i just wanted to show you the nothing phone one secrets of customization and how you can turn the phone into a pedometer with the default widget which comes with this phone 
I hope you have liked this video. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that bell notification up because I will be making more videos like this. So thank you guys. Have a great day. Thank you.